Hello everyone, so today's question is, if x, y, z belongs to the closed interval 0 to 1, then find the maximum value of the given expression. Now the given expression is in the form of three variables as you can see, x, y, z and within the given mod and root over is taken here. So first of all, in which interval the mod is defined, so mod, sorry, root over is defined, root over will be defined for any value of x, y, z because mod is here. So mod will ensure no negative value comes inside. Now the second point is we can calculate the minimum value if the expression would have given in the form of only single variable. So here three variables are given. So actually if you look at mod of x minus y, it gives you an idea about the distance. Here. And if I want to convert this into a single variable, it will be very easy to calculate the maximum value. So let's assume x is less than or equal to y is less than or equal to z. So here what we're going to do here? Uh, if mod of x minus y represents a distance, so I'm going to make this term as the maximum. If you want to make this third term as maximum, you're going to take this as 0 and you're going to take this as maximum 1. Now y will be floating between 0 to 1 in order to max maximize this term. Okay, so I'll write the remaining expression. The remaining expression is root over. Here you'll get mod of y, that is y. Plus next expression will be root over mod of y minus 1 here. And this term will be equal to 1 here. Now the given expression is converted into a single variable. Now I want to calculate maximum of this. So as you can see y is floating from 0 to 1. Now we have to select a y for which it will be maximum. So it's best to convert, take a y as sine square theta here. If you take y as sine square theta, you will get root over sine square theta as mod of sine theta plus. And here since its mod is given, I can write sine square theta minus 1 or 1 minus sine square theta. So it will be equal to cos square theta and root over cos square theta is mod of cos theta and plus 1 here. Now, if I want to calculate the maximum of this, first of all, I need to remove the mod. Since x and y are from 0 to 1, I can write mod of sine theta as sine theta and mod of cos theta as cos theta and plus 1. Now, let's say this is equal to z and the maximum value of z will be as you know, the maximum value of a sin theta plus b cos theta will be, the maximum value will be root over a square plus b square. Now in this case, it will be equal to root over 2 plus 1. So our maximum value will be root over 2 plus 1. 